Oh, oh. In the chat? Yeah, in the chat. All right. Oh, I'm going to give us a Here we go. Fun song Ooh. for 10 minutes. Fun song. The song on the... It, it just says... Oh, this is this is the old... This is just the bubble tea time one. Okay. Are you live? Are you live? There's Maybe. a bubble tea time. I'm on live. I... I... I met somebody put it in BTL general. But... I'll put it in BTL general. Oh, make your thoughts on you. Oh, you put it? Okay, you put or it in. Announcements is fine too. Yeah. Okay, yeah, Rebel this Band. This makes more sense actually. Pretty strong right now because the patch hasn't hit. Ooh. Oh, crap, you're right. Frickin' Rumble nerfs not yet. Yeah. We have a patch in the middle of playoff week one week. <laughs> Something, something. We don't know Riot's scheduling. Yeah. And that's okay. <clears throat> right for those rumble nerfs. Same. You're not looking to ban Morgana though. Uh, I don't know if if Nishant's gonna play it. He has played the rumble. Have either of them played Morgana Jungle yet this season? Mm. I don't remember. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. Did they not have a Morgana Jungle game next time? I can't remember. No, well, they did. They had they one. The yeah. Sopa played one. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah, yeah, think yeah. Nishant played one. Mm -hmm. Alright. Anything slip through bands? Mm, slip the bands. Pantheon bands. catches me off guard. Yeah, and the Lucian's through. Tristana gets denied. Hmm. Oh, really. they're looking to play it. Okay. Who plays it on EXO? I mean, I assume uh, Cincy plays Brent? it. But then, I... is it a Lucian bot play? I mean, I'm not gonna be surprised if Javier just plays it. Like, let's be real. Yeah, I think that it can flex, but I agree. I think Javier's the most likely. But it's also like we don't know if Javier's gonna be top or mid. I've never seen Javier play Lucian. Again. That's the only thing. Yeah, but we also haven't seen him play a lot of things, and then he just plays them. <laughs> Is that gonna be on Gwen Lockin? I don't. Yeah, I wouldn't imagine so. Zane on Pocket Ash pick. Mm hmm. They did run uh, Zane on support Ash last time around against Pio. That's true. So. Mm -hmm. Some possibilities for some shenanigans here, though I suspect it'll probably just be an ADC Ash. I like the Morgana. Yeah, There's some Morgana. The shot definitely plays jungle Morgana, so I'd say it's most likely to go on him. But yeah, yeah, Matthew Confirm. also does play it, and so does Man. So that's yeah. oh, true. I mean. They might have had a plan with the with the Pantheon ban, like they didn't want it into Lucian or something, but I think if they weren't going to pick the Morgana early, it's a better ban there. Yeah, Morgana's scarily powerful. Is she getting nerfed today too? She is, yeah. But I also think Sejuani has a hard matchup, because you can't clear as quickly. The Black Shield is pretty strong into Sejuani. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What about it is Sopa's comfort pick, though. The legendary AP Sejuani Adam. <laughs> <laughs> just pop the shield. <laughs> now it's hard. Looking more like Lucian Bottom. Oh. I, well, yeah, I'm like I mean, Malzahar. Certainly, I, I've also never seen Tim play Lucian Top, so. Thomas Kench. Who's crank? Oh, come on. I would have loved to see flips. the crank. The flips. Wait, it's not confirmed yet. Bye, guy. All right. Sure. Feels like a man pick. Yep. It's going to be a pretty boring mid lane. Bowser, <laughs> mm. mm. Vygar? Yep. Yeah. Yep. 
I mean, these 2v2s are going to be boring as well. <laughs> Sejuani Mouse are 2 <laughs> versus probably Vigar Morgana. I don't know. Karma gone. Raffle going through. Oh, I need to do the um. Start the prediction. Oh my god, why are the uh, crazy takes one gift sub per XO win in playoffs? <laughs> one gift sub. Let's do, let's do 10 minutes. Expand. They still think that there is a possibility for the flex for the Lucian. That's pretty interesting. I thought that Vigar was almost surely going to be a man pick. I don't think anybody else on that team plays Gwen, so... I think I've seen uh, Yui, Yui, Yui play it. A little Yui bit. Plays Gwen. Hmm. What, are the, what are the predictions right now? Oh, XO with 10 points? Hell yeah. I wanna wait till I see the full draft before I throw down all my channel points again. Mm -hmm. You mean your Boba points? Boba oh, points! Fish. Boba points. I like the Tom Kench to the Malzahar and said Ronnie. Yeah, it's not a bad mm -hmm. pick. I mean, mm -hmm. and they have a they have a immobile back line that they can really give a lot of safety to with Thomas Kench and uh, Morgana, giving tons of safety to Ash and Vigar. Yeah, and the zone control of Vigar Cage. Yeah. Braum. Lucian well, I mean, Braum. Said, obviously Lucian Braum. Lucian, but... Yeah. I mean, MBS has a I lot of utility right now. Secret. I mean, they they have damage on their champs, but I think that their top laner needs to be someone that can offer some, you know, reasonable damage. I would expect the Yui set coming to play. <laughs> I mean, I think, think Ash, very good I think Ash Bygar were going to actually offer a lot of damage. If I were an MBS, I would pick a top laner that offered me, like, some engage or something. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's pretty situational damage. Morgana's damage is all single target after she hits the Q. Uh, yeah. And I guess her ult, but. Vigar and Ash's uh, damage isn't super situational, though. Yeah, Vi Vigar's going to have some trouble yeah. shredding these tanks, though, right? Like, I think a set is really a good mm -hmm. a good option. Yeah, I mean, Yui def does play set. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, that isn't particularly great into Volibear. Camille. I mean, Camille. That also does. Ooh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. <gasps> the AA trucks. That seems uh, really weird. Uh -huh. to me. I yeah, I was a big fan of the Camille. <laughs> um, I'm not as confident in the Aatrox, but. Yeah, I think the problem that the Aatrox could face here is like, you could just get locked down and shredded before his healing comes in, right? Because, I mean, he's he can absorb a lot of damage, but he has to be dealing damage while that's happening. I mean, I think uh, it's... But Exo has the... I think it's difficult to play Aatrox into this comp. Yeah. I mean, right. there's so many tanks. <laughs> I, I don't... I, I'm curious how much value you're really going to get out of Aatrox in this comp. Oh, Exo got a lot of points there. Yo, how, how are just throwing the points? They did. How does Aatrox think play that, in Volibear? I, I think that is a lot easier to execute. Yeah. Yeah, no, no, I, I agree. I, I do think, I agree with you, I think Set would be a pretty good pick here, for sure. Um, pretty interesting, the Aatrox pick. I actually think if they had picked Camille, I would have been really happy with that draft. If I were Yeah, the Camille <clears throat> rounded out that draft really well. Yeah. Cause... It gave them another form of engage, it gave them a way to deal with the tanks, it gave them pick, yeah. it gave them strong side lane. I mean, it gave them side lane, that's all that matters, right? Like, who matches Camille in this comp? Nobody matches Camille in this comp, yeah, and then like, there's so much disengage on NBS that they can buy a lot of time and space for Camille to just do Camille things. So I, I don't know. I, maybe I'm a little depressed that we didn't get the Camille out of UE too. I wanted to see it. I know last season on THD he was he was trying to play it, and we never got an opportunity to whip it out. Um, but Aatrox doesn't seem like it accomplishes the same things that you would want a Camille to accomplish. I'm going. I'm playing the odds. 
Yeah, the Lucian, I know Lucian has fallen like out of vogue as an ADC uh, pick, but you know we have the traditional Lucian Braun bot lane, and I think that with the with the chance that XO has and the chance MBS has, this Lucian is going to be. I mean, if he could be able to free hit this entire game if he plays it right. And I mean, since he's kind of again. Oh my God! Fifty-five K went to NBS. Wait a second. Wired, you voted with me this time All around. Right. Wait, hold on. <laughs> no, I was playing the odds. Dude, you just have to I wait. <laughs> you gotta be the wait, last. You have to wait. Yeah, you have to wait until after Wired throws the swing vote. <laughs> hey, this is poor shit. <laughs> the problem is that Wired votes with his brain, and I vote with my heart. Oh, I, I looked for the, same the odds, and I, that's I, why I, I used half my points now. I I vote with my heart, <laughs> and I lose all my points. I'm slowly collecting. I've only been investing a little bit of points, so I can just like throw a bunch of points on one of our games and then lose them all. Dude, yeah. the secret strat is that you rewatch uh, vods, and that's how, and you get channel points for that. Wait, you do? Yeah. I'm gonna watch every VOD we have. <laughs> I will say, uh, in terms of like pick order, maybe XO is really worried about someone like Sejuani or Malzahar being banned out. But I feel like the volley there just makes way more sense to be picked in that first rotation. Uh, since he's a flex, it makes banning a little bit hard. Uh, it, but the question is, is he actually a flex pick? We must all make our choices. Yeah, you have flex on any team in BTL. So I go. Wait a second, you choose the ch Wait. I can't use those. Why can't I use those? Yeah, I mean, no matter how questionable this Aatrox pick is though, I, I can't help but to think that I, I think this Exo team is going to struggle to really access like Bygar and Ash in this comp. They their only like real diver is like Volibear, and there's a lot of ways to negate Volibear dive. You can Tom can't cheat somebody. You know he has to get through the stun. I mean he can be unstoppable getting through stuns, but it's gonna be difficult for them to get a ton of value solo. The Malzahar, I mean, it's just gonna they're gonna have to play front to back really well and find like their spots to catch people when. All the like, you know, free get out of jail free um, buttons are on cooldown. So I still think it's a pretty, I don't know, difficult game for EXO to like. I mean, I, I think they have a, a comp that can win. I just, mm -hmm. I don't know. I think if, if NBS plays really well um, and like carries are able to s stay in good spots where they're close enough to supports or like, you know, these supportive characters to like bail them out of really bad scenarios where they might be caught in the front line of like a front to back or something, I think it. I don't know. Nameplates off, I would favor, I still think I would favor the MBS comp here, but. Wait. Did we see the swap? Oh. Chieri mid. Okay. Chieri mid, Javier bot. Yeah. Fancy. Interesting. It's Whoa. fucking with my unit frames once again. I respect it though. I mean, I guess we, we could have, we could have thought about it for a second and realized that Braum wasn't a very Chieri-esque kind of character. Yeah, um, but you know, you guys are just now saying that you don't think that Javi's gonna take Braum mid, and I'm not. <laughs> Man, <laughs> you know, he did convince me one season that about Braum top and was popping off on it. So he also played all these star mid. Mm, true. Eric top lane, we remember that one. Yes, you were on that team. Yep. I, I mean. <laughs> Nobody, nobody thought about the the Malzahar Braum bot lane Lucian mid lane into Vigar though. Oh I my mean, god. That's true. That is a possibility. Oh, no. That's the character with the best matchup in the Vigar in this team. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> do we do we need to remind people that they can't be in Twitch chat between their games? I haven't seen anybody in here, but. It's Should because we're be still an important part of my culture. No, during uh, yeah, but uh, it's because people are talking about the game. 
yeah. So you might say like, oh, this team should pick like this next time because of blah, 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 blah. Mm. Mm. I mean, it's something we can't really monitor though. You know? It was just because before people would be like hopping in and like typing in Twitch chat. So then you know like, okay, well, they obviously could potentially be listening. But I mean, obviously yeah. it's like, I mean, obviously it's like a, we trust you not to do it. Hey, I'm going to do that shit all the time. Charlie. Yeah, hey, what, what, are you, what are we not supposed to do? I love shit posting in between games. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I, I just think that it's pretty hard to like monitor that, you know? If you found a way to monitor it, sure. And if you really wanted to be serious about monitoring it, you could. But... I mean, it's more of like we trust you yeah, not I mean, to do it. it. But like if one of your teammates tells us that you were doing it or something like that, or like we see you in chat or something... You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, the same I mean, thing where like you can't like... could also be something on the casters for the casters. You know, if we wanted to be serious about that too, we could also just be like, hey, casters probably shouldn't talk about what they should do for the next game or something. I don't like, know. That's, but then like, again, I guess that like, runs a... Part. I mean, that also runs a really sketchy yeah. line. Like, what if we're in champ select? I'm like, man, Camille would be a really good pick here. And then they're watching. They're like, shit, they said Camille would be a really good pick here. What about that? You know, I, I, I yeah, guess... Yeah, exactly. I guess there are a lot of blurred lines there. I mean, we can just... Yeah. I guess you're right in the sense that we can just trust people to not I, I don't know it's a, it's a lot of hazy lines for me but yeah it's yeah i think it's just more of a like trust not to do it but if we find out you are doing something like that then there would be like a penalty yeah i mean maybe worth a larger conversation for sure wait uh sorry what are we not allowed to do elena is saying that she doesn't think that people should be allowed to be in Twitch chat like between games. Let's say your game one is done and game two is starting or something and you just, you know, you're in the next game but you know, we have a 10 minute break period between games, right? So maybe you're in chat and then like Adam and I are like, man, Camille would be a much better pick. Next time I would ban this and pick this, this, this. And the team that would be in the game is, you know, potentially gaining knowledge that they wouldn't have thought of themselves, I guess. Um, so that's, that's her concern. Which I think is a valid concern. I just don't think we could potentially monitor it in any way or anything like that. But I mean, I don't know. Well, I mean, put it this way. Like, imagine the LCS level, right? Where a team goes back to their, like, little, you know, huddle between games, right? Like, I mean, they could, I guess, have a stream up on their, like, PCs, you know? And, like, be hearing... Oh! Shit. But LCS right. teams don't give a fuck because you're really going to listen to a broadcaster and what they should no. pick. No. You yeah, know, we're in best of threes now, right? Yeah, best yes. of threes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, you know, are they really going to listen to a broadcaster and what they could pick? <laughs> fuck no, they got people that they pay for that shit, right? So, yeah, I don't know. That. To, to me? <laughs> like, <laughs> fucking stupid, dude. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I would only listen to... Yeah, I don't know. I, I mean, I think we. I mean, I think you're right in the sense that we can just trust people not to do it. But I do. I mean, I, don't know. I guess. <laughs> I'll just give like really step bad step recommendations actually, between going games. A step further, I was saying that I want to be able to shit post in the Twitch chat between games because it's funny. Yeah, I mean, I think there's like discussion for that too. Like, fucking meme lord Adam here. <laughs> yeah, bro. All right, here's my reminder to swap out the bro and Mel. So hard to start and see where they go. Do I got the overlay on? I don't think I do. Yeah. Oh, I do. do. Whoops, I turned it yeah. off. Now I turn it back on. We're just waiting to see if uh, it's a uh, Lucian mid. No, I'm pretty sure it's so a Oh, yeah. I probably should move that. <laughs> there we go. 30 oh, bottom. wait. Oh, oh they, they're oh, spotted. Man, and, uh, oh, they did. Did oh, they see he, it? I mean, did surely, they see Surely they saw the animation, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, they get a. Warden, MBS gets their own wards, uh, a little they're further out. Is this the lane swap? swap? Are they? Or did they not? I mean, it looks like it. Looks like a pure lane swap. Minions have spawned. So, MBS scouted blue, but did not ward it. Oh, are they gonna just go <laughs> Jesus side? Or, like, what is going on here? Oh, they're just gonna yeah play for the top side. Oh, oh Timmy, not paying attention. Oh, wait, he actually scouts them. That's kind of big. He That's sees the big. he sees the bot lane there. Yeah, and they yeah. see that they're going for the invade, so that should signal yeah. Sopa to go invade on the blue. Yeah, now that he knows they're verticaling. Uh... Oh, 
He gets a good leash, which is what he really needed in this situation. I mean, Sopa, go, Sopa, Sopa's go. got no, right? Sopa? What's he doing? I'm going to Raptors. He's going to, Raptors first. He's going to clear yeah, his Raptors. pawn first, remember? Raptors is already... I mean, wait. I mean, isn't this so much harder for this pot for Aatrox to survive here than yeah. the... Uh, what's it called? The Volibear? I mean, the bear Volibear. into Ash Lucian, Lucian Braum seems pretty lethal against someone like Aatrox. Volibear, I mean, they, they, they pulled off the lane one. swap. Also, oh. okay. Sejuani so coming up to fight uh, for the Gromp. Wait, so, but why? Wait, so why? I mean, it's not terrible. It's not terrible if he actually he fights for it, right? Three, but it, it, but it's, it's very awkward his, overall. It's also on his weak side. So it's kind of it's kind of weird. Yeah. Well, I mean, Empress just took a lot of damage from Gromp there. But Matthew's there to cover for him. But he didn't get so the Gromp. No one yeah. gets the Gromp. That's actually not bad. I mean, Sopa does I mean, have a little bit of tempo, and can he can go down to his strong side bot like mm, bot side now, which is shoved up yeah, anyway. Yeah, he's pinging it now. Yeah, I mean, Sopa can make a play here if his bot lane is understanding of what the play Brom's is. Braum's moving towards him. Yeah, I mean, surely the more consistent play is to go right from red to the enemy. Oh man, Tim is playing with fire. I'm not sure what this play was, but... Oh! He's gonna be okay. Try to be aggressive there. I think he probably could have just picked up the wave, but has a TP. They burn top TP, which is pretty good for NBS. Yui's just catching waves safely. We're kind of looking at a dive angle, just waiting there, not taking the camp yet. I don't really think it's ever going to happen, but we'll see. Brahm's coming up here too, actually. This is really interesting now. Oh, they're going to spot him. Oh, they're going to go for the dive. Oh, anyway, it misses! Wait, Matthew under tower! Nope, not under tower anymore. Empress is under tower. Wait, Timmy shots, though, yeah. taking a lot good of Good wall from Hobby. Good awareness from Hobby. I mean, Maybe they're just matching top because they think the Lucian is going to be fine in this solo lane. It should be fine into the solo lane. Look at the CS differential already. I mean, Nishant's coming over. They spot him on the ward, so... NBS should back off here. Yep, yeah. just got spotted. Oh, the slow the comes flash. in. Fire Knight's trying to finish him. Gets him for first blood. Matthew. Oh, there's the oh. TP. Oh, the miss! Oh, oh the oh, he miss. barely misses. The next auto gets the stun. It's gonna be a lot That's of kills over to NBS, nice though. Nice cleanup for NBS. Man with the TP gets. Killing an assist. Yeah, Fire Knight lives through the whole thing. I mean, it's just roses for NBS. This bad I think, on the top lane is crazy. I think the problem with this lineup for XO is that Mayan's going to be able to abuse this mid lane, right? I mean, he just got that TP and walked back without getting punished at all. He's I don't know what the the number one, number two mid laner rated in the in the league, uh, and I think he's just gonna be able to abuse uh, situations like that. I mean, Cherry had no mana, so I think it was just an unfortunate case of back timers. I mean, you reset the top lanes, and overall the lane swap gave a decent advantage for XO. Like they got a plate and the dragon. Timmy's level five. Well, it's not like he's gonna ultimate sure. the tower, but they also, you know, gave up two more kills. 
<laughs> Timmy's level five. <laughs> Scary. Still pretty decently, like but yeah, the moment you yield, Tim, it would be in a very precarious position. Master. And Yui should feel very, very comfortable with that play. He still has his ult. He has flash. Here. Oh, uh, that's a lot of damage here. Jumps He's got out. The shield up, it's though. a good wall. I think it's enough. Fire Knight. But is it enough? Get the entire rest oh, of the no, squad coming in. Go down, right? The Fire Knight's Ash gonna go down. down. So there's one. Since oh, he's side side the side step That's on the Q, the, the stun comes. Oh, 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 the auto. Can't dodge that. <laughs> Man hitting the outplay button. Gotta love, gotta love Igar. -R. That was nearly insane. There's no outplaying Vigar R, but. It was just. One auto away. I mean, this from... is this is the second time though, right? Vega's been able to walk down to a lane, entirely change the outcome of a fight, and gets his full wave. Yeah, this this Vigar is going to be huge. Um, yeah, and they they don't really have good ways of killing him, like we mentioned at the yeah. draft. Yui takes a big chunk of damage and is forced to ult out. Don't know if he can. He wants to stay for the wave. And Matthew's coming in to give him backup he needs so he can catch it safely. So is Man, actually. Oh, oh it's a three man coming in for Mr. Parox Rostar. He thinks it's safe because Sofa's up here, but he doesn't realize how many people are up here with him. And there's spoon feeding kills. Okay, that one goes to Sinzi. Sinzi Soul. Not to be confused with Sinzi. Need to remind myself of that one. A Sinzi versus Sinzi type of game. Taking away the blue buff. And all of the top side of jump camps. It's gonna be a very time. Timmy. Hard, Timmy. Oh. Timmy's playing with fire here. He has Ooh, old hand nice flash. Has cool. no way to keep him in though. Yeah, forcing the ult down of Tim. Nice dive. Nice. Gonna get a lot this is of actually place a first one tower. of gold for the XO bot lane. Which a snowball Lucian mid game can do a lot of work. Mm -hmm. Especially he with Malzahar. Because people are there. With, mm -hmm. with the highest gold on the whole game. So. They I'm also have to deal with Malzahar mid game, which is really hard because you either are getting ulted or you have to pay your taxes and be down 1300 gold. Yeah, so I'm looking for Sopa to actually make a play up down mid. Cherry has Malzahar ult and has been sitting on it for a while. At the very least, looking to try and blow some summoner spells. Looks like Exo's making a play for Dragon. They currently have numbers yep. advantage, but Nishant's on the way. They're clearing. Ooh. Zopa only gets hit by one part of the spell combo. And now okay, he's eating a more. bit of damage. Cage is down, so they're looking damage, to start though. it. 
Okay. We're gonna pick up their second. Job. And they know they don't have a cloud soul coming, so it's a good soul. Infernal. Here's the infernal. It's all right for that team. Solid. I mean, I would have. I, I would prefer like mountain. I would have preferred mountain. Yeah. Yeah. Mountain's yeah. Better for them, but still. It's all right. It, it does amp up on their damage, which was one of the things they were kind of lacking is late game damage. So if they can get soul, that does counter their uh, or cover their uh, late game damage dealing. I'm still trying to fight with a level disadvantage and into a minion wave. He needs to answer this bot wave soon. Yeah, she still hasn't used her teleport this game. Uh, it's a little awkward. And they also, you know, mid still has five plates up, and she's down in CS uh, to the roaming Vigar. I feel like this lane slot for Exo might not have been optimal into MBS with Man playing at a, you know, pretty high level. Yeah, I think it also might have been in response to the uh, pick ban. Empress is here. Oh, they picked the first time. Oh, oh nice! Oh, he gets snared, so he can't R. He's Ring now. <gasps> the ult is enough. Ooh. The flash. I don't know. I think it strikes me as something they planned out because they picked Lucian first. LeBron makes a lot of sense. Yeah. They picked Malzahar first rotation. No, I agree. Something definitely premeditated here. I don't think it's particularly working. It's... Mm. Thoughts on the Kraken Slayer on Lucian over Gale Force? Kraken Slayer is fine. Um, I assume he's. Uh, deciding that he'll never be able to hit anyone besides Tom too easily, and or it's just bursting through the Tom okay. or Rage Rock. But I mean, I would go Gale Force if I felt like I needed to get away from like CC and stuff in this game. But mm -hmm. I think Kraken Slayer is a decent item anyway. Like I don't know, you, you do get if you get in a burst combo against someone, you can cycle multiple burst combos, do a lot of burst combos. Like I'm, I'm still pretty happy to go and Kraken Slayer this game. Yeah, but Kraken I mean, Slayer is I really. Think, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have been angry if he get, went Gale Force either, though, considering um, the by guys in this game with Everfrost. Yeah, I would have preferred the Gale Force, but not by a lot. NBS is looking to put some pressure down for Rift Herald, taking the Exo blue buff I mean, right now. Ooh. Matthew. Is in trouble. Should shield here. Malzar yeah, yeah, is here. No, Malzar yeah, ults the ash. Oh. H box coming in the back line. Oh, gets Vincent stunned off. Goals very far back. Oh, he's gonna get so flash. Flash. Get flash through. They don't have enough movement speed to get there. It's a one for one overall. Oh, Cherry uh, might be caught. Yeah, no. uh, Forces oh. to flash out. Yeah, the heal goes down too. I mean, I still think that fight was exo favored. They didn't have to burn a TP like uh, MBS did. Yeah, the gold's now down to only 200 in favor of MBS. They also got both sums off of Tom, which is pretty nice to be able to bully the frog.
dragon is about to spawn. And the big thing here is neither top laner has TP. And Cherry needs to move down with her team. She's looking to reset, get an item, and possibly TP in. Tim's already heading down. And he has to start the dragon. <coughs> Stun's down. There's yeah. four hit again. Actually, not very much damage goes down. That stun is down. I think this is their Overfall opening. Is yeah. down. Dude, that's huge. The There's the knockup going in. And Emperor's gonna stop. Ooh, get oh, oh someone gets through. the dragon. Oh, here's the Soul Point in the back. So now. Oh, it's gonna be going up the so far, and they're still going. The stun here is gonna stop Lucian in his down. tracks. Big chunk on them. Okay. They there you go. Back away. Take your win. You got the fight win and the, the dragon. Third, third dragon. Two kills too. Oh, flash on Nan here. Might be invested. Depends. Nope. Well, Timmy has ult. Yeah. He just ults out of that. Oh, steps on it. Not gonna hurt him that much. He yeah, doesn't really believe sad. in damage at this point. It could go. Ooh. Ooh, they're looking to go in here. They don't have their damage anywhere nearby. Uh, bit of a, a weird little combo here. Tag from the Braum, but it's not going to get them much. Is Viger maxing Cage second? Yeah, what the fuck? That Cage cool. It down. is second. It's level 4 already. Wait, you, you always max Cage second, though, no? I don't know. I don't play back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I do. Real Vigar is Max Cage first. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> oh. Trying to get this steal at the oh, 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 the smite steal. Nice with Calm over the wall trying to get her back, but can't. Yeah. I mean, but <laughs> you trade your life in a flash for it. Flash and Morgana is kind of a big deal. You're not going to get it either. Yeah, and they're making sure that nobody tries to cheekily get over the wall to grab it. The gold's a thousand gold ahead for NBS, but they're down three dragons. Yeah, sitting on, <clears throat> sitting on Infernal Point. Not a bad spot to be in if you're EXO. Ooh. Oh, unfortunately, the ult goes into a Oh, wait. Javi tries to step up and block. It has to invest the You're flash. A couple seconds behind from me, Brian. Am I? You might be. Well, I can't speed it up, so. Okay. What's the time at for you, Brian? 20 right now. 20. Okay, you're uh, like two seconds behind. Dan, could you just pause for like a second? Yeah, I'm the Twitch streamer, so and I can't speed it up, so. Yeah. We All can right. just commentate sounding like we're talking <laughs> super fast. <laughs> we're just clairvoyant, that's what we are. We react as it happens. NBS has a lot of vision set up in EXO's topside jungle, and it looks like that ward over by blue might get unseen. Or not seen. NBS has some deep vision sitting in that blue side. Yeah, and you see the pings from Matthew. Uh, picking out the ultimates. I think he's waiting for the Ashel to be up so that they can synergize their abilities and get some pick picks all right you level 12 to tim's level 11 oh never mind level 12. the dragon's up in a minute um kench is resetting they have vision down for now. Both top laners have TP. This is a really good trade out of Timmy right now. Yep. 
Let's get the extended uh, get the trade. Oh. Uh, oh, you hate to see it. Oh. The extended trade actually goes the way of Sinzi, and with the life steal off the passive, he's gonna get back pretty healthy. Yeah. Whoa. Exo does have complete control around Dragon right now, except for the deep wards. Yeah, 19 seconds I mean, for a soul it. point fight. Oh, Ooh, the goes wide. Goes down. <clears throat> but the cage is down. Oh, and has the flash. Cage is down. Ashult is down. Aatrox is here. Aatrox is here. Got ult for the Get suppressed. Get suppressed. Hey, look at, look actually at this. This is all that's about to happen. They have enough space. Yeah. NBS just can't get in. Oh, but They're Cincy, chasing too far, though. The cage. Stuck. Fire Knight's doing so much cool. damage! Fire Knight just chews yeah. them up! The Quadra to the Vigar. They're gonna run to the Baron here. They're pretty hurt. Oh, nope. Looks like he's just gonna secure the dragon. Probably just shoved out mid. Get a reset here. That was such a close fight. Honestly, blinking re red on pretty much everybody from NBS. Yeah. I mean, if the volley was there a little earlier, that would have helped. If they, if Exo just <laughs> took the, the small win and turned onto the dragon instead of chasing into the corridor, where Vigar could just, you know, zone him out again, uh, and they didn't have a way onto the ash. Yeah, and since he actually, since he flashed there because he was scared of the Aatrox, but the Aatrox actually got immediately suppressed, and so it was a little yeah. bit unfortunate. Like having flash later in that fight could have been everything. Could have flashed away from the Mayan combo that kill, ended up killing him and killed the Ash with this flash. Like, there are a lot of options there, but a little bit of a miscommunication there on where that Malzahar like, ult would be invested. Yeah, and I mean, Volley ult is their, their way to get on Ash, right? And after mm -hmm. that was used to kill the Aatrox, uh, they, they can't keep chasing into small spots. They don't have vision. The fight was super good from Exo at the beginning though to buy that much space and save time for Volley Bear getting there. Yeah. So although the fight wound up get, going NBS's way, because they also played it very well, the beginning of that fight from Exo was insane. Mm -hmm. They're building up the bot wave. Ashel goes in. It's the Sejuani. It's not the best target. Volley Bear's Volley Bear's solo Volley Bear's back there. Volley he can't... Oh, he flashes out actually. Solid, since he might kill off Tom Kench. Nope, Tom Kench lives. Sopa Tom ult since he survives. gets the gray health. But it's gonna be two. Bezlehar was walking up because there wasn't a good ward. They did put out a ward in, across the river, finally, but she ended up just peeking to the mid wave. Just Tom Kent, guys. You can get the, you get the turret in response, but if you're in BS, you're happy. You got a Baron. You're looking to now shove out waves. I'm looking most likely for opt turret to go down. Vigar AP check. He's got 263 stacks. That's a lot of damage. Or a total of 833 AP. I gotta say, this one's starting to feel pretty out of reach for XO. They're having the same problems that they've had all season. Uh, that, you know, MBB is no stranger to either. Uh... Don't say it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh no, that's Ma a huge pick. The Malzar passive being popped earlier is that Cherry just gets CC'd. There's nothing they can do to deal with these cannon minions. Like, maybe a calling is the only thing they have that can reach it, but then Tom just blocks it. Yeah, I mean, this entire comp is a really short range comp playing into an Ash Vigar with Tom Kench and Morgana. Like, it, it was always going to be difficult. Nameplate's off, the nameplate's on. And man, against Chieri was 
a pretty no. difficult matchup to contend with in mid lane. Hey, is that bet that we did, is that for game one or is that for the series? <laughs> I think it's for game one. Game one. Game one. Oh. You wanted a I mean, whole I stand, series? I stand, by, I stand by it, but I'm just out of money now. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> you wrote XL game one? Oh, you know it. I, I did guess too. I could. I guess it's probably better to make it the whole series, isn't it? I like the game. Oh, well, whatever it said. Whatever it said. Right? Oh, I like this collapse from NBS, <laughs> and oh, it's yeah. gonna be a wash. This collapse is oh. huge. Oh, Sinzy okay. kills Sinzy. <laughs> oh, Ashult goes wide, and that was honestly pretty huge from Sinzy killing Sinzy Soul. Just runs him down with the culling. But NBS has their eyes on the prize. The dragon spawning right now. And soap is no, not gonna be anywhere near. Me. It just gets harder and harder for Exo to deal with them from here. I mean, this this dragon alone is gonna give Vagar another like, what like forty AP, like six percent more a AP. Yeah. Exaggerate. It's like 15. Well, doesn't he have? He has like eight. Yeah, I clicked on it. Like I, cl I clicked AP, on right? it. He's at eight. Right, and it gives and it gives what five percent additional? Four. Four. Four percent additional. Okay. So 800. So 32. He's, he's just shy of uh, 850. <clears throat> oh, so like never mind. Thirty-five AP. He just hit 900 with his. Whoa, 964. Whoa. What's happening he's, with his AP? he's jumping around with items that he's buying. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. Yeah, they yeah. the they inevitability of Vigar is here. <laughs> Are you saying he Thanos snaps people into out of existence? Yeah, did you see that ult earlier? No. It's basically the same thing. <laughs> you just point and click someone. Once you reach late game enough, you don't even have to click anything else. Is Sinzi gonna go for this? He's, I feel like he's just gonna be cheeky, yeah. <laughs> that's a pretty loud recall animation. It makes it look like the, that's like a spell. Ooh, tags the Vigar, but the, there is no follow up. Gets the flash. Get the flash out, so. Morgana's, Morgana's on the side. They have to step back. They can't do anything about Morgana being there. Tim is here. Oh, oh nice. Ash down. Aatrox is just going to destroy the back line. Yeah. You can just hide away. Mm. That. That's game w. one. GG. Man, just locks up. Ah, those autos. Yo, can we go back to where AP did not increase turret damage? For real. Good yeah. dumb change. And that's game one to NDS. Okay. That's true! That's the first time in like two weeks. Oh my god. GG. GG. Alright, 10 minutes, so 8.04. We get the points out for game one. I think in the future we'll, it'll be series. We'll do uh, game by game for this one though. Oh my god, wait, Elena, you can't say that. What? You can't make it for series, that's a gamble off of one draft. <laughs> hey, you gotta do the gamble before the draft. Yeah, and you gotta think beforehand. There. Lucian actually did by far the most damage that game. Consider that's a lot great. of damage. Considering he was their sole damage dealer, really, uh, through the most of this game, it makes sense. But hooray! I made five hundred channel points. I lost five hundred channel points.
That's okay. You can try to win some on this next game. 91 Kago True Wired and 7 others. Who will win game 2? There is. I have to make some offenses for somebody. Not to. Oh, I guess I should tell them at 59. It's a 59, is it? 59. Be right back. So I've taken a pretty big brain strategy this series of making them their backs go against the wall very early. I respect it. Okay. I mean, now they're just going to be stronger. They know they can't lose, so they couldn't possibly. Exactly. The logic checks out. Ryan, are you hungry? Huh? What? Are you hungry? Uh, yeah, I guess. I can order something. Uh, do you want them? No, I was gonna make the noodles. I'll take something. Okay. We still have to finish the curry noodle. I also have the french fries that I haven't finished because I don't feel like heating them. I hope you can see some more Cinzy on Cinzy action this game. <gasps> Wait, no, Brian. Oh my god. Wired has reminded me with his Happy Meal. The BTS meal at McDonald's has come out and we need to get it. <laughs> There's a B BTS meal? Yeah, the BTS meal at McDonald's. What did it comes out today. I don't know, but I want the, I want the cards. If they have cards, I'm still not sure if they actually have. Oh no, it's May 26th. It's tomorrow. Oh, I'm okay. gonna go get that. 10 piece chicken nuggets. Oh, I'm not a chicken nuggets guy. It's You're not a chicken nugget. nugget? Chicken nuggets from McDonald's is just like pureed things that might be chicken. I mean, it tastes <laughs> awful. Medium Coke and fries and Cajun and sweet chili sauces. But does this, people are saying that it comes with cards, but that, and they never actually confirmed if it does. So I feel like it might not. But that's what I wanted. I'm back. Welcome back. Indeed. Was that it for the game? I thought they had a best of three. They do. That was game one. <laughs> that was game one. Oh, okay. Okay. <clears throat> Are we not naming these tournament rooms anymore? should have named it but I don't know if you had a code or not Dan or do we have mm. any codes John for these if not it's fine I no I, I do not okay oh are you guys using tournament codes for this we were testing stuff out and um what I, I was that was what I was telling <coughs> you about, uh, when we were using it the moment we got a sub in it it right. broke the game so it didn't like it didn't uh, update stats online. Lame. Eh.
my god. Okay, so they released photos of each of the members of BTS, like Edie McDonald's and whatever. But oh, they still yeah. have the BTS members, but they haven't confirmed if we're getting photo cards or not yet still. But it's looking kind of sus because they released these photos that are all in kind of like the shape and style. I just want the photo cards. I take it they are some boy band. You don't know who BTS is? K pop it's, it's, dance. No, I don't know who BTS it's, is. I mean, <laughs> yeah, you guys are crazy. It's dance. He lives under a rock. Oh my god. Hey, like, my fellow really rock liver. I don't know BTS, but like, they're like, kind of like fucking huge. Like. They're popping off. Oh no, I would say that his channel points will trickle down. That Reagan shit out of here. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we'll find out tomorrow for sure. I imagine it is going to be very upsetting going to McDonald's in LA tomorrow though. For a particular reason. Because everybody in LA knows everything and the army is going to come for these meals. <coughs> Just like when they had the Pokemon cards and they were like sold out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be the same thing. I've got some of those Pokemon things on my desk. So, lucky. Walker stole oh, from the <laughs> from McDonald's. That's what I know. He went I in stole from them? Yeah, you said, give me all the Pokemon cards. Yep. I also have stickers. One of each. We got the ones from the cereal box. Jack Limestone is right, the Shrond sauce all over again. The Szechuan? Okay. Because when Szechuan sauce originally came out, I thought you couldn't even import Szechuan peppers into the U.S. during that time. So did oh. it actually even have Szechuan in it? I wouldn't be surprised if it didn't. Yep. I had to be... With zero knowledge on the like, on the subject, let me clarify that. I'd place money that they'd do it without the peppers. <laughs> All right. Spec R for Chancellor for game two. Yeah. All right. I saw my screen. We need to set up the playoff video doc game records. Oh, you're right. Oh, it doesn't contain <laughs> any <laughs> Sichuan. No, Confidant. Yeah. You think that... Let's see. <clears throat> when was the ban? Sichuan. No, we already had the playoffs set up for the same. This is fine. We just had to put the names in. Yeah, 2005 is when they finally could start importing Sichuan. Yes. Like, even when the original one came out, they would have never even been able to put it in there. Interesting. Didn't you uh, import it? Uh, no, I think it's super expensive. Oh, wait, you couldn't. Huh, wait, no way. What? How the fuck did you eat Hot Pot then? I don't know, but you couldn't, you couldn't import Szechuan peppers until 2005. Have they started this pre or not prediction? Have they started the draft yet? It no. appears like new. No. I am streaming the draft, by the way. Ellie. I see it. Oh, it was only loosely enforced. 
Why couldn't you have until the SARS basically? Why couldn't you have the peppers? Is America a good enough answer? <laughs> All right, All right. Going. let's get started. Let's go. Right. Game two. Excel's looking to bring it back. Bananas just described for four months. Let's Banana go, did? bananas. Is that yeah. just because MBS just banned your sign right now? I mean, the time would have been very appropriate. Coincidence? <laughs> she said, smiley face. How do you get tier two and three subs? What do you have to do for Donate that? Donate more money. Pay more money. Subscription. Oh. So nobody's ever gonna get to use these team logos, are they? Except for me. Elena. Yes. <laughs> that sounds like you're <laughs> flexing. Yeah, so sticks with the rubble bit. Interested to see. They're adding the Tom Kenshin instead of the Thresh. Will I mean, they ban the Morgana? They might ban Thresh here. Yeah. Ooh, and NBS is respecting the Malzahar pick. Oh, they're banning the Lucian instead. They're letting the Thresh through. Maybe. What? I mean, I'm guessing it's going to be a Morgana first pick, but uh, I guess with NBS it could be Ash as well. So even if they lose this game, don't they have to go again against the other team? What the no. hell it works? Oh no. Oh, no. They're in losers bracket, so it's just single elimination. Then who does NBS go against in the bracket? Whoever lo whoever loses of the top bracket. Oh I see. And you're right. Calling it out. First pick Morgana. That's a terrifying pick. As a Morgana one trick in BTL. <laughs> Sorry, Scion. I moved on. Oh my god. I mean, it's just a very consistent pick. Uh, I mean, it can be punished, but only by a limited pool of champs, of which, you know, like Xin Zhao is one of, and always gets banned against me anyway, so. And then if they pick one of those champions, you just go lol and swap Morgana to support? Yeah, take dinks. <clears throat> Okay, Jinx right, pick. Okay, Jinx. Jinx Blitz. Oh, Jinx Crank. Blitz. Oh, that's yeah. aggressive. <laughs> okay, I love it. It's not what I expected. If you're going to do something like this, I thought it was going to be Jinx Thresh for sure, but... I mean, it looks to me like it's still going to be Javi support then. So I'm wondering what they're going to go with mid, like a Lux or a... Uh, something like that. I mean, they they might be trying to force the Morgana to go bot lane with the Blitz pick. Eh, I mean, there's tons of picks that are fine to... Exo's taking us on a ride, and I'm excited. <laughs> I mean, Ezreal Leon is fine. Yeah, should, so is Ezreal Nautilus. Yeah. Ezreal Alistar is really good in the Jinx Blitz Crank. There's a lot of fine picks here. Cow? Ooh? I actually just got Moo Cow Alistar. I hate that skin. I love that skin. I have it on my other account, but... There's Maybe just something the about now. ring. Blitzcrank is a wildcard pick on the ropes. I mean, yeah. Let's we'll see what it can bring you. So Juani again, Juani again with it into the Morgana. Yeah, I really don't like that matchup. Me neither. It's also very scary having Blitzcrank and Morgana because you don't want to pull Leona, you don't want to pull Morgana. Yeah. Uh, I just feel like the... when I play Sejuani into Morgana, like, I'm getting out farmed, and if I show up anywhere and Morgana's there, like, play's over. You can't really do anything. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I forgot to give you the other overlay. Oh, yeah. Wait, which side are they on? Is NBS blue? Yes. Yes. 
the Vigar band coming out. So is the Volley Bear from NBS. Is Ezreal a, a Fire Knight pick? It is. I've never seen yes. him play that. Okay. I think he plays mostly Ezreal, Ash, and Jinx, two of which are taken. Uh, he also plays a little bit of Zaya. Shen ban once again. Sandy ban. The Ari pick. I'm getting the idea that they're going for comfort. I don't know if these are champions that they <laughs> yeah. to play. I mean, you're on the ropes, but... so maybe, but... I think Ari would play very well into brand. That's what they're going for. Yeah, it's pretty good. Can you get a Nocturne pick? Nocturne can go mid or top here. I mean, yep. or jungle, obviously, if they wanted to play some Ghana, so still a lot of questions. There you go, Brian. Malphite. All right. So probably a Nocturne mid or Ghana jungle, Malphite top. Mm-hmm. What does Tim pick into the Malphite? Pick Fiora. Pick Mordekaiser. I mean, Mordekaiser wouldn't be terrible. Can I still like set? Oh, Silas, Silas is out. Oh, yeah. that, that, that that makes sense. That's yeah. like a hard counter. Makes sense. Yeah. Yep. Uh, Tim's been practicing ooh. this. Yeah, I mean, counter or not, though, nameplate's off. This Exo comp is going to struggle. How is Jinx going to live to this? I don't know. God tier it's positioning so and nothing else. Yeah. Bro, I'm calling it right now. This is gonna be a Timmy Diff game. I'm gonna put my other 72 channel points on it. <laughs> oh, did you just give me the overlay now, Elena? Yeah, I give you the new right. one. I'm gonna Wait, did I vote on? Did I vote for MBS? I thought yeah. I voted for. I can't vote for EXO. Oh, bro, I voted for the wrong team. Wait. <laughs> Rip. Oh, there goes your 72 points. Oh, my 430 that I voted for bef with before. I'm gonna add my 72. <laughs> oh, let me change the. Right. There you are. All right. There's 80% saying EXO will win this one. The people have confidence. The names are on the opposite sides as the names. Uh... In the draft. You're duller than a broken yeah. sandwich. Yeah. You don't have the heart to this. Damn it, Wired, you can't control the swing of these. <laughs> wow. Boxfire could potentially break. I went all in. I have zero channel points left. I know. Well, I voted on XO last time. I went for NBS this time. Now we got 76% <coughs> for NBS. Yeah, Wired voted. That's what happened. <laughs> yeah, I see it. 70k points to NBS. Hello. It's Charlie, I've returned. Welcome back, Charlie. Thanks. Welcome back. Know. Should I play more Biomutant tonight or what? You'll oh, make noodles. For some reason, I'm going to stream the game. There you have the heart of a 
Okay, so the prophecy came true. It is on hot. It is a hobby blitz drink. Blitz drink mid. Let's go. Blitz drink mid. Ari support. I'm a believer. <clears throat> Jenny asks, "Will you, we wait ten thousand years for spectator delay? What are y'all's favorite things to eat when you have a headache?" Uh, my favorite thing to do is honk my car horn over and over. It's and not, not what the question was, Adam. <laughs> While eating french fries for McDonald's. Just dehydrate yourself even more. <laughs> Smoking cigarettes. Tea and toast. I mean, for me, one of the big ones is literally eating like an edible, like with a good amount of THC and CBD. Don't know if it actually does it, but that seems to help. When it's like a really it does, bad I mean, it does if something. It, if it does have a bunch of CBD, then yes, it should do something. That and some Excedrin. He smokes weed for a living, so you can trust, uh... Yeah. Hell yeah. Stop spreading false rumors. Wait. Do you not smoke weed for a living? Oh. No. <laughs> My whole life is a lie. You know, in movies, when there's, like, a drug deal, and one of the drug bosses, like, pulls out a knife and, like, cuts open the bag of coke, and then, like, rubs it on his... <clears throat> on his, like, gums, and is like, yeah, this is good coke. That's what Dan does. Good job. <laughs> oh, and I'm me. only like 40% <laughs> accurate, but like... 40%? <laughs> yeah. He does it, except he does it with weed. That's that's what you do with weed, right, Dan? Yeah. <laughs> you rub it all over your gums. Oh, God. Oh. He just takes a nugget, eats it. <laughs> Imagine fucking gumming weed. Jeez. <laughs> it just made me like... Uh. <laughs> No. It doesn't even dissolve, it's just fucking <laughs> has little bits there. It's just there. Oh, I got oh. some more channel points. I'll put them on. Marker's throwing me down. Oh, Fu is a good choice from David. I don't really get headaches too often, so I don't have a go-to. I'm crushed with having migraines all the time. Y usually if I'm getting a headache, it's because I'm dehydrated, so... I've been working on not being dehydrated. Water's pretty good for you. Yeah. Typically. I feel like there's a there's a food for every food question. Breakfast burrito. Oh, it's just I love breakfast burritos. They're so good. I have been committed to making them for years. Like it's just been my thing. Like I just make breakfast burritos. Here, and the, I can send a picture of one of my old breakfast burritos. I think this is like 2016, 2017 breakfast burrito. What, wait, you have a photo of breakfast burritos that old? Yeah. Damn, Walker. Are you serious about them burritos? I'm committed. We've been in a long relationship. Food. You're in a long relationship with burrito. There it is. Mm. Pretty good.
Oh uh, yeah, space groove blitz crank. Space uh, groove blitz and crank. Oh, you're right. I take it, Brian. That that skin's not not allowed. Hmm? Base groove blitz. Ah uh, no, it's not my job anymore. It's McCain's job. I guess. Wait, why is the skin not allowed? I don't know if it is or isn't. I I believe it isn't allowed, but it doesn't help that blitz is really meta right now. I mean, if you want to coin toss a game, you just whip them out. <clears throat> Pro teams need to write this down. If you're losing graph, whip out a blitz crank. Like, you can just see if you land heads. If you land heads, you're good to go. Somewhere out there, Bjergsen's like, I was on, he's like writing in his notebook, he's like, man, I was on this Bubble Tea League <laughs> Twitch channel, and some fucking guy said. <laughs> they're at Worlds, they're playing against Dom Juan, and they're like, time to coin toss the game, baby. <laughs> Thank you, Poo Walker. <laughs> Poo right. Walker is here giving drafting advice. No, NBS is worried about Anakin's right now. They grouped up together to, in case of the Blitzcrank invade. Exo sees MBS starting red or blue side. Interesting if they just uh, invaded like well, 15 seconds ago. Ooh, man, emoting off the bat. It's a power move. <clears throat> Is Nocturne top and mid good during in five five vibes? Yeah. Yeah. He just shoves and runs. I, I like this push by MBS bot lane. The moment Blitz hook goes down, they posture aggressively. And at both games, MB or Exo has had really good vision of MBS pathing and really hasn't done much with it. Uh, you know Morgana's gonna gonna do all three camps on the top side. I think that you have a chance there to invade after your blue buff or before, ideally. Ooh, Matthew gets so solo so XP low. there. So his love is desynced from Fire Knights. <clears throat> This is really good 2v2ing out of the EXO bot lane so far. I don't know why, but it is so frustrating as any character for me to go against Silas. Because you think you got him like down to no health and then it's just like, nope, I'm going to slap you around and I'll be like that. Remember that when that was an execute? Which was the next appearance? The W. Oh, I didn't know that. Good times. Yeah, really aggressive that. trade from Tim. Ooh, flash Good away. Flash. <clears throat> oh. Ooh, that was I don't close. think Javi would have wanted that. Morgana yeah, still needs to get <laughs> Yeah. That was a risky one to go for, but... Oh no, Sejuani invading after they had vision, they saw the blue was taken, but it doesn't get too far. Were they thinking about a dive, maybe? Maybe. maybe. Oh. Ari's in a lot of trouble here, that's a lot of damage. Gonna have to the flash. Flash, flash, flash follow, yeah. gets flashed auto, it's enough! It's gonna be a solo like, over man. Uh-oh. It's no Hobby flash on the jinx. He's doomed. Oh, the snare actually Morgana. misses. Snare misses. Oh, he get out. He just out. Out. Hooks the up. Morgana. Oh, the Forces okay. the flash. That's the best Hobby could do there. Oh, he fixes the score words. It's gonna get real yeah. shitty for uh, Malphite and Silas' is sick. Hmm. <laughs> Got exciting yeah. range for now. Oh, 
Uh, Sepp is sh Oh, like it's showing out of the bush. Se yeah, Sejuani is not a champ that can lane gank super well. The, the animation is showing out of the bush. It just yeah, showed it, again. It, I mean, it is again, right. You knows. Surely. This just isn't something Sejuani can do when you have a melee. Wait, oh. And, oh. Oh, that What's was a flash out. But, you know. Having no flash means as soon as Timmy hits six, it's coming. Oh, before Timmy it's hits in, it's coming. And that's a kill. Ooh, there we go. They went oh, over to Sopa, which is not ideal, but still a lot denied for Malphite. Yeah, and. Exo is trying to run away before Nocturne hits him. Wow. Ooh. Uh, uh, I don't think you need a flash there, right? You yeah. could just walk left. I mean, I've been misled by that hitbox many a time. I don't blame him. Yeah, but you don't die anyway. Yeah. yeah. Mor yeah. Morgana's not six. Yeah. yeah. Level five Morgana with Ionian boots. I, I wasn't sure if uh, Nocturne had to shun back up in mid lane. If he yeah, did, fair then... enough. Also, Ionian boots first buy for Morgana. Trying to spam out the abilities and power clear more, and be able to fish for more Qs. Here comes Here. the Q. I believe. Oh, Ooh. nice buffer Ooh. from Fire Knight. My goodness, that was ridiculous. The action comes. Fire Knight has no E. Can't get in here. Nocturne's bot lane though. This is enough. Yep. Cinzy still has no flash. No, no flash heal. Here. That's a dead Gonna Jinx. At least one down. Uh, hello. The Jinx is not dead yet. Lamau. <laughs> Oh, she's dead now. No yeah, assist for but, Fire Knight, though. Yeah, Fire Knight gets nothing from it. Oh, Sopa's oh. in a lot of danger. I mean, there's not much kill pressure here. Morgana's still, still not six. Yeah, but it's this more like the game bot lane just so is yeah. so, Sopa, you're playing with fire, my friend. Man so, saying don't come back. This one feels kind of over. I think there's some decent scaling on XO, but it's going to be so hard for Sinzi to do anything with it. Yeah. Like, what's a Jinx supposed to do fight. here? Nocturne, Leona, Malphite. Like, what do you do as a Jinx here? Buy Zanyas and just Zanyas every team fight? Ooh, Tim doesn't. Ooh. Oh, but he ults in alt range, tower range. Still goes down though. Still goes down and ult comes yeah. through. Yeah, Lots over. of people dead. Oh man, would the great XO experiment end without a win? Decent trade there from Cherry, but don't know if it's gonna stick. Yeah, it's Nocturne, it's not gonna stick. The pokes are relevant. Nocturne's walking topside, but on a ward. So they know exactly where Mayan's going, but they can't really do anything about him taking these chickens. It's just getting harder and harder for Sopa to play the game. Get spotted, gets pinged out, and they know he's the top side of the map. Nocturne should potentially look to make a play bot. The XO bot lane's resetting. There's the Nocturne, it forces the... I don't think... I think Nocturne pretty much just wants to ult bot on repeat here. You're not gonna get anything from ulting the iron. You don't really wanna let Silas get the Nocturne ult. 
Ooh. Fight on top. Mm -hmm. Zinzi has ult though. Yep. Just gets out. Really well played by Zinzi Soul. Absorbing all the gank pressure. It's so hard for Sofa to do everything or anything here. The jungle matchup is like impossible. Camps are getting taken away. There's no good ganks. Malphite just ults out. Botlane has Ezreal just ease out. Yeah, I mean, I think part of that was in his control. I think the the pick, I mean, you know, was bad. But I think you know, both games they've had full vision of what the Morgana is doing, and they haven't really exploited it. Uh, and they've just kind of let her take camp. like she's. If they just go camp for camp, she's gonna get more camps, right? She's a Morgana. He's a Sejuani. Like. You're not going to be able to outfarm that, so you gotta be able to take camps away if you have vision. Yeah. Red team's turret has been destroyed. Fighting in the mid lane, that's a stun locked Ari. Tim's trying to trade. Tim should get one back here as soon as. The oh, Ooh. there's a W. Nice solo kill from Tim. This is looking like a Silas versus the world type of game. <laughs> yeah. Bro, if I win channel points because I bet on the wrong team accidentally, is there a way to donate channel points to, like, the bees? I don't know. Uh, the... I don't know if you can take channel points away. To, to, to Wired. <laughs> Wait, why, why are you breaking the economy more like this? I read a post that Ginny was going to, what, show up at someone's house if Wired got about a million channel points. Okay, so Man's just trading ult for ult with Ari again. That's very good for XO. If the Nocturne yeah. ults just keep getting traded, I mean, Ari maybe no what he's flash, trying though. to do is just uh, blow cool pull her off waves. But I, I agree. I don't think it's Matthew positioning off. very aggressively. Should go down here. Just hit by Skybreaker. Gets feared. He's doomed. I love Matthew's aggressive positioning, fearlessly saying, I'm willing to trade my life for all these kills. Okay, 5v5 breaking out in the bot lane, or 4v5 breaking out in the bot lane. Matthew is very far Leona's back there. just chilling behind them. The other members That's of XR are chasing, so this is a um, This might be a, fight. the fight that they wanted. Shutdown goes onto uh, the side list. Is this the top diff that was foretold in Legend? That 300 gold differential says, perhaps. <laughs> is, this, is this the prodigal Timmy playoff game? And I was trying to combine metaphors. <clears throat> All right, we've got a hobby miracle hook in four, three, now with two. a Malphite hovering above them. <laughs> you know, you miss all the shots you don't take. And if he'd gone in there, he probably gets both of them killed. Yes. Um, 
I've got to be honest, I didn't see the Malphite, but... If he had thrown that pole and it landed, yeah, that would have been sick. Uh -oh, we're about to have a dead Sopa. Oh, Sopa's going very far in. The Q hits the red buff. Sopa got the red buff. But now, the... can they say, get Sopa out? I mean, Sinzi's if Sopa dying... gets out, Sinzi should die. Yeah. Alright, Sinzi died for his sins. We got a Malphite ult on Silas, I think. Oh, nice! Oh, time. That was oh, beautifully that was really done. Well Sopa cleans there. up the kill. You know, it's a couple minutes later, Walker, but you called it. The god hook landed. <laughs> My timing wasn't right, though. Yeah, I did. Thank you. As long as Chieri is handling Mayan in the side lane and continues to get Mayan to blow his uh, cooldowns on her, that's a huge win for XO. This Nocturne is terrifying. Is Wani making a good choice with the build? Uh, last game went for the Sunfire Geos, but this game just knowing that you don't have the economy, uh, going for the cheaper build, going straight into the probably the War Mogs right after to get the 3000 HP. I mean, you're, you're going Mercs. I feel like you really don't want to go Sunfire Geos on uh, top of it. I don't know. Do you really need that much tenacity? I think it's more about the, sun, the Sunfire Aegis than the Mercs, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah And I mean, sure. you might be able to bring Morgana Q down to like 5 seconds of duration if you buy a ton of tenacity. Ah, uh, yes, instead of, you know, an eternity. <laughs> it's a minute. Bit of a miscommunication there, I think. Yeah, really nice execution, executor. I think that with the Nocturne, they're just afraid of... Well, if we try to save him, we can't heal for the rest of the game. Oh! Hey! Nice steal from Ooh, There Sinzi. it is. Wait, I thought that was damage capped. It was. It's oh, 800 oh, now. Oh, Timmy! Timmy goes oh, for it. No. Oh. He got the Eye of the Herald. <laughs> That's true. He definitely says, since he, you made the effort, I'm going to finish that off. He wanted the faster but recall. The problem with that is that Dryden is spawning right now, and Tim's not going to be up. He will have TP when he spawns, though. Yeah, yeah. he used his Leona ult. I mean, there are other ultimates to steal. Malphite's huge. Do you have huge. an option time? Morgana's have huge. Um, he should have it relatively soon. A big thing to take note of is NBS does not have the Malphite ult. The Nocturne ult just came off of cooldown. I mean, they have Leona and Morgana ult. That's a lot of zone control already. Is Exo just gonna go for a big push with Geld? Looks like it. Jerry's not aware near her team though. Matthew's going. They're going on Cincy. There's nothing they can do to field the team. That's a wombo. <laughs> and this is why. Brilliant fight from NBS. And Matthew gets the snare. Goodbye, Jerry. Gotta kill back. That's a W. Yeah, it's kind of still feels pretty over. Yeah, Ocean Soul coming in in one dragon too. If they don't end the game before that, like wow, Leona took nothing. nothing. Red team's turret has been destroyed. Yeah, Leona doesn't believe in taking damage. Uh, <laughs> true. This oh, Javi's coming in. 
Ezreal's gonna use the and E, Javi opens up E, Q, guaranteed CC lands, the E comes in from Sejuani. Ooh, there's just not quite enough. I feel like they could've just tanked the turret. The rest yeah, of their team was there. I think they had Q, that. Q in there, smite. Did he yeah, already use his Sejuani like Q? The, I don't know. The world ends with you, character. Can't let an ADC by, be by themselves like that. Wait, what? World ends with you? Yeah, doesn't, doesn't the Ezreal skin look like him? Oh, is it the arcade one? That's the arcade one. Yeah, I think it was meant to. Oh. They're all dead here. Oh Ooh. my god, that old. Give him that trip, please. Bro. NBS looking clean to bounce back from their loss streak in these playoffs. Seems like it's just a matter of cleaning everything up now for NBS. Take away every camp in the red side jungle, move on to Baron. XL might be able to catch them. No. No, they can't. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> it's one of the rougher things in League of Legends is when you're. Oh no, Javi's coming! <laughs> no, he's not going for it, though. I mean, that's not a super important ward. I, I don't know that they'll be fighting there in the next uh, minute and a half. Or even walking there. As I say it, they walk over it. <laughs> NBS has completely taken over the bot side jungle for dragon spawning in a minute. Ooh, he went for it. It yeah. was close. Once, once they get this ocean soul, I mean, unless unless it gets to Elder and Exo just like gets a wild Elder, I, I don't I don't see a way back into the game for them. And the harsh reality of the game right now is Malphite can 1v1 Jinx. And as a top or as an ex top laner, I have to appreciate that. But as someone who plays ADC, I know how miserable this can be for Jinx here. Walker plays every role. That's true. Confirm. He'll play Sun in every role if you let him. <laughs> I'm. You're not even Let's wrong. Those like, down. Ooh, that was a and good engage since he's blown up immediately. The rest of the team is following suit. With this knockdown combo is disgusting. And quadra, ca casual quadra oh. from Fire Knight. Oh, Malphite. F's in the chat. Yeah, for, you gotta respect for Malphite Knights. for that. No, no, no. F's in the chat for Fire Knight's Penta. That's my dad. That's my dad for right here. Stoles, Penta. You know who? You know who wouldn't have been able to do that? Old Fire Knight, most improved player. Fire Knight, <laughs> the eighteen other Fire Knights. I think have Fire been able Knight to... eighteen wouldn't have been able to do that. <laughs> Would you say it's like Fire Knight and Day? Like Get him out of here! Get him out! Like that out of here? Bro, I liked it. We all Honestly, know that's very much true. Your opinion is I, the only I thing hated I it. care about. I hated it. I hated it. I hated it. Morgana ult, they're looking. A miracle team fight. fight. Timmy doesn't get on the Ezreal. The Ezreal ease away and has Black Shield. It's it's not. It's not it. Sinzi Soul has ult. It's it's only a matter of time. The heal goes Ooh. through it. Matthew lives. Oh no. Oh, never he, mind. He dies to the ignite in the end. The tension. Yeah. When's the Malphite ult coming through? Wait, I, I think what you, were, what you were implying was like fire afternoon 19 does not get a double kill there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Twitch just Twitch chat flaming you guys for your jokes. 
Bananas likes it. Fire of morning. Of course he does. Bananas, so everything works <laughs> Mayo says he's disgusting. Hey, no, fuck bananas. Fuck that chick. Yeah. Uh, Amory does have notoriously bad taste in everything, so. Yeah. Uh, GD with the proper response that Fire Night 21 will be lit. So the ocean soul has come out for NBS. That's that's the icing on the cake. This game's done and dusted. What does the and dusted even mean in that saying? What's the saying? Done and dusted? Is that not a saying? Yes, it, I guess. Ah, uh, you're gonna make me look this up now, Walker. <laughs> you brought it up. My curiosity is there. Like, um. Like shattered to pieces type of thing? That would make sense. And like, uh. You just dusted your sugar donut and I would have eat it. Um. Let's see. Some maintain derives from the habit of sprinkling absorbent dust on documents to dry fresh ink. Well, that sounds like what I was saying about the donuts. Yep. Uh, the appearance of the expression in print cannot be found before 1964. Uh... But the Ooh. blotting up. Oh, oh, was insane, but they don't have enough damage. But now they're a bit wary. Black Shield is down. Hobby should have hooks soon. So far. So throws old, but like... he's burning through. Oh, this oh, Malphite's oh. terrifying. It's only a matter of time until the ult comes out. Jinx does have flash, though. Can Sinzi Soul predict the other Sinzi? I want Sinzi on Sinzi action. Last time Sinzi won it, but I am so frustrated. Ooh, with nice little soul. spell shield on the Nocturne to stop the Blitz hook. Okay. Always nice when people use their abilities. Only one shame on me. Fool me twice. Wait, other way around. <laughs> oh. Ooh, Jimmy goes in for the ult. Gets but locked down, there's no Zanyas, so that's... But look at this, Fire Knight 19 finishing with a 1-1-1-1. One, 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 one. Ah, yes! The binary numbers. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Wait, it crashed for me! This is bullshit! It crashed for me too. <laughs> no, we were so well, close. We had one. We had one job client. So close. It crashed later than normally, though. All right, uh, who do we want for our post-game interview? Sing, 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 sing. Okay. I'll take it. I'll check it's out. Welcome. Fire nut. Fire night 21. Yeah. Who won this game of MBS? Complete the prediction. Enjoy your points. 16,000, baby! Yeah. <laughs> That's not a Fire Night 19. No. no. <laughs> Alright, we got Fire Night 19. He is. Player of 18 other Fire Nights for the post. Yep. <laughs> 18 oh. other Fire Nights, huh? Yeah. Had to take the 19. Dude, that was a spicy, spicy game. Hell yeah, man. It was great. There was a lot of good uh, back and forth. A lot of good engages on... Uh, me and Matt just going all in, and I kind of just cleaned up. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. How how Rob did you feel from that pent to kill? Uh, <laughs> you know, I didn't eat, like honestly when I was walking up to the fight and I got like the first one, I was like cool, and then I didn't even expect to get the triple, and then the quadra, and I was like <laughs> I don't care about the penta, I just want the. Besides, if I had gotten the penta. My score wouldn't be one 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 one. True, true. It would have ruined it. Yeah, I knew what I wanted. <laughs> All right. 
Well, yeah. Zane, coming into the playoffs, your team wasn't looking so hot. And how did you guys uh, rally for trying to make a playoff run? Uh, honestly, we, we've been neglecting our League of Legends duty. And practices have been have kind of harder to get nowadays. But uh, we're coming in strong. We're, we're hungry. We're th I want the win. Uh, and I'll, I'll put it down right now. Uh, if I win first place, I'm getting the Scuttler tattoo. Probably like on my back or something. So we can like all look forward to the that. Rebel Scuttle? Yeah, like the River Scuttler. I'll get that on my back. Oh, if we win man. first place. So Wait, what happens if you don't if you don't get signed by NBS again next year? Then that's fine. It's that's that's okay. just a <laughs> it's like a trophy tag, I guess. Yeah, I guess it'll be so. like my first BTL win, and uh, it'll be a good time. But if I don't win, uh, no tattoo, sad face. How in the chat says everyone into NBS after that comment. <laughs> All right. Um, so looking at these games, uh, it seems like you guys felt fairly secure throughout both matches. Was there any point where you thought, uh, it's a little dicey or? Uh, the first match we were, <laughs> We were struggling. Uh, we were talking about how it w it should have been easier, but um, they're Lucian, man. Just rough. <laughs> we couldn't do much against him until the late game. And then uh, going into the second game, we were pretty hesitant on actually who to play as far as, like, for me, because uh, Ash's uh, arrow is pretty, like, you know, important to the kit. But we figured if we did an all-in comp with, like, all the stuns from Malphite, Leona, and uh, Nocturne, the arrow would just be icing on the cake, so they were just like, play safe. Uh, originally, also, <laughs> the idea was to have uh, Matt just not be in lane at all. <laughs> okay. And just have me, like, 1v2. Um, I think it worked out. Also say, uh, Dan, this is for you. I had to type in my own chat, don't get hooked. Ah, uh, yes. And I the, and I think it was the like you know you have to make it into reality. I had to type it out, look at it, say it. I think I, mean, I got hooked one time. And you buffered your e properly, which is yeah. really awesome to see. Yeah. Just can't get can't do it too early. All right. My <laughs> fi my final question f from me at least was, uh, who are you looking to face in the uh, next match, either THD or GB? Ooh, that's hard. Chew Heart Destiny is a really hard team, so I'm gonna hope that they lose. <laughs> so wait, you're hoping THD loses so you go against them? <laughs> oh wait, what? I thought they're they're in winners bracket, right? So oh, if they lose, they're... they drop down and play. Oh. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. That so makes you're sense. Gonna... but then, um, hmm, yeah. Yeah, let me look at the bracket. Where is that? <laughs> it's in the BTL document, sir. Let's see. Is that under announcements for it's, the... Is it the I last believe, thing? I believe it's in general. BTL general. So, Nutterbutter Scuttler versus EXO. We won, so we get moved up. Mm -hmm. So who are we facing? The loser of THD versus GB. All right, uh, T8. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I need THD to win then. Okay. So, for the easier time. Uh, uh, come on, where's the confidence? You just got your big win, playoff win. Yeah. Build the momentum from it. Ex exactly. I want to. Okay. I, I need to carry that momentum all the way through. So you know, little victories turn into big victories. So we'll take the easy fights when we can get them. <laughs> okay. Okay. Fair. Fair. Uh, does anybody else have any more questions? Where's all my f questions from from chat? Pog. <clears throat> I was gonna ask uh, how it felt to steal Malphite's right pentakill. <laughs> uh, the pen pentakills don't matter. Wins do. What? Uh, Nick, I am wearing socks right now, and pants and a shirt. Who plays League of Legends fully dressed? Right. <laughs> No, 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 Any no, no. truers? D 
Yeah, their articles don't matter. I was inquiring about the socks. Okay. <laughs> what color socks? Uh, black. Always black. Classy. Oh yeah. Uh, <clears throat> and everyone, all the real winners drink uh bubbly sparkling water. That that's a sponsorship for tonight's game. Bubbly. You're doing Nick proud. <laughs> Of course. <laughs> All right. Thanks for the interview. Good luck on your next round. Peace out, stream.